We are at District 4, just right outside the core central region and Propylene Brothers is bringing you to one of the youngest HDB that have just reached its MOP right here at the Harbourfront Precinct. High floor, unblocked view, let's go. I got a job in the valley but today I did it go. The entire Tolo Blanga Ridge view consists of 70A, 70B and 70C and uh, the unit that we are going to show you is at 70B and 70B is the most convenient out of all because you are just right within sheltered walkway to this bus stop and if you are outdoor lovers, you can easily just cross the road and you will reach the Tolo Blanga hill. Right, so we are right here at the unit itself and before we start the home tour, why not we share a little bit more with you about this project right here at Tolok Blanga Ridge View. Now there are a total of 492 units right here split amongst 3 rooms as well as the 4 room configuration. Now for a 4 room configuration right here, you have a total of 396 units and out of these 396 units, you either have the sea view or the Tolok Blanga Hill view. And because we are on level 24, and that also means that we get this clear unblocked view that is overlooking the entire Tolok Blanga Hill. Now, if you are looking for a HDB right here in the Harbourfront precinct, we can then further segregate them into various zoning. So we have the Depot Hill area. The balance lease over there is about 78 to 80 years. If we are to move slightly towards the east, we have the Mount Faber area. The flats over there, they are having a balance lease of 50 over years. With one particular cluster adds a balance lease of about 70 years. And if you are to move slightly towards the right, you have the Bukit Permai area. Bukit Permai was built in the earlier days. That is having a balance of about 60 over years. Now, Tolok Blanga is one of the bigger plot of HDB cluster at the Harbourfront precinct. Of course, the slightly matured cluster are all situated closer to the MRT station. And those have a balance of about 50 over years. So right here at the Tolok Blanga area, if you want to get a new HDB cluster, you will have either the Tolok Blanga Ridge View or the Tolok Blanga Park View. Right, so I think enough of the introduction, why not we kickstart the home tour straight away? Right, so for this unit itself, owner has spent about forty over thousand dollars just on the renovation because you have these two cabinets that have been installed and home shelter that is to the left is tucked neatly behind this door so it gives you a flush and neater appearance that goes all the way towards your living area At living hall, you have a great span of distance from the sofa to the TV You have four panels of window that gives you a lot of natural sunlight and I think this is a great view because you are overlooking the entire Tolok Blanga Hill. If you notice, there is no AC installed in the living room purely because the moment you open up the window, you do get a lot of natural wind ventilation that comes into your unit itself. And for this unit, because we are tucked at one corner overlooking the entire Tolok Blanga Hill, that also means that you will get full privacy right here at the unit itself. TV feature wall as well as uh, cabinets have already been installed so I think all these are great for you to store away all your clutter. Moving on to the dining area, you can easily fit in 4 or even up to a 6 pack seater right here. Now in the event that you want to remove part of the section of the wall, you can easily do so. Or if you want to double out your island countertop to be part of your dining space, you can do so by means of removing this wall. But otherwise, you can leave it as it is because the glass door has already been installed. And if you are someone that prefers to do a lot of heavy cooking, then I think this will come in very handy. Now the entire kitchen has already been installed with Galaxy Granite Top as well as the glass backsplash so I think all this makes it very easy for you to do your maintenance. Cabinets at the top and bottom have already been installed and if you prefer to have more storage, you can easily install top hung cabinets right here. Of course, the entire cabinets comes with internal laminates as well as soft closure that has already been installed. So I think overall, the entire kitchen is in great shape and condition. You do not need to do much. And laundry area, Great in size, you can fit in like a washer, come a dryer on either side and racks have already been provided for by HDB. Also overall, I think you have a moving collection kitchen and uh, I think we're going to share a little bit more with you about the master plan involvement right here 
at Harbour Front before we show you the rest of the bedrooms. Now because we are right here at the Harbour Front precinct and that also means that we are right in the heart of a major transformation called the Greater Southern Waterfront. Now the entire GSW stretches across 30km of coastline right from the Marina East all the way to Pasir Panjang. And the total land size is about 2,000 hectares and that is about twice the size of Pongo. Now what's going to happen right here at the GSW is that there are going to be major facelifts where there's going to be enhanced connectivity, there's going to be more housing developments as well as more commercial land that are going to be developed right here and this is just going to increase the entire vibrancy of the GSW. Now of course one of the enhancements that's going to take place is the circle line where additional stops will be connected from Harbour Front all the way to Marina Bay. And in future, on top of the Northeast Line that is already serving as one of the stops right here at Harbour Front, you will also get the Thompson East Coast Line that will either bring you towards the city centre or towards the East Coast area. Now because we are in District 4, that also places us right outside the core central region uh, where we are in the RCR zone. And if you have to just take a look at some of the areas of the RCR where the HDB flat prices are going at now, you have Boon King and Kalang. And for the HDBs that are approaching the 5 years mark, the asking price is already going at 900 over to a million dollars. Of course, if you watched our previous episode where we just sold the Boon Tiong, that is right at the RCR zone and the asking price is also going at about 900 over 1000 to a million dollars. So naturally, because we are in a prime location that places us just a few minutes drive away from the CBD as well as the major transformation that's going to take place in the next 5 to 10 years, naturally, this location commands a premium and if let's say, after you stay for 5 years, once the entire GSW has started to take shape and uh, you want to rent out this 4-room flat, we believe you can fetch a conservative rental of about $3,000 and that is going to place your rental yield to be at about 4%. And I think at 4% at this location, this is considered good enough. I think with the master plan involvement, that also means that it is going to be easy for you to exit in future. Now this is a 4 room configuration so you have 3 proper bedrooms that are intact. Now for this bedroom, wardrobe has already been installed and this particular bedroom is currently fitted with a single size. You can even go out to queen size so for this particular bedroom, all you need to do is just to bring in a bed. And uh, similarly for the other bedrooms, uh, this is identical in size. So you can either put in a single size or a queen size or a study table. Wardrobe has been installed. For these two bedrooms, they will be sharing a common bathroom. Common bathroom condition is still great. Now, master bedroom is great in size. You have a two-door wardrobe that is tucked towards one corner. Now, of course, in the event that you want to have more storage space, you can easily install those kind of L-shaped wardrobe space. Just do some minor configuration to increase your entire storage space. So even after installing a L-shaped wardrobe, you will still have sufficient space for you to place your dresser table or your baby cot and this is currently a king size bed so if you do not need a king size you can then scale it down to a queen size and that is going to give you more room but just to give you a sense of the space with this current king size setup you have ample of space around you and uh, i think the placement of furnitures you want to have a side table or reading zone you can easily do so so of course right here you have the master ensuite that comes with the shower screen, toilet bowl, sink as well as a ventilation window. So there you go, if you are looking for a moving condition unit right here at the Harbour Front Precinct that is in the heart of a major transformation that is going to take place in the next few years or so along the Greater Southern Waterfront and you want to be on a high floor, this kind of unblocked view that gives you a lot of cross ventilation. And if you're a nature lover, then I think you've got to check the rest of the place out with us. Do give our listing manager, Alan, as well as RU a call. My name is George Payne from Problem Brothers. Always happy to show you the place. Alright, so we are right here at the unit itself and maybe you oriented you a little bit. Oriented you a little bit. Alright, so we are right here at the unit itself, so uh, but I got no time to cut my hair. You know my hair is just a $2 haircut. 
Yeah, there's something on my forehead. My oh, wrinkle lines. Your hair. Your hair. You got hair, but you got hair there. Yeah, your hair. My, my hair. wrinkle lines on my forehead. My wife keep on saying. Your forehead very thick. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think my wife, my wife say, why you have such a big forehead for what? We space. <laughs> of course, one of the enhancements is that the, 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 